Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're taking you on a tour of Parade Home Number 22. It is located at the ledges. This property is 4,756 square feet, has five bedrooms, five bathrooms, two stories, and it says here a two car garage, but I'm pretty sure it's much larger than that. Let's go check it out. This courtyard. I love the ledges. So I think the entrance is through the casita. A lot of homes in this community have these detached casitas because they're often used as a second home or a vacation home. And having a separate entrance, oh, the sign for the casita is right there. This is actually the main door. The casita is right there. The Ledges of St. George is an exceptional golf community featuring 7,200 yard par golf course, an exceptional clubhouse, as well as these 360 degree mountain views with views of the Snow Canyon State Park. Many of our clients have relocated here and they absolutely love living in the Ledges. If watching any of our videos inspires you to move to beautiful Southern Utah, we would absolutely love to be of service to you. Please reach out to us anytime. Give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email. We absolutely love when we hear from our YouTube family. This is so cool. It's not often that you get snow in this view. <laughs> so here you're right, right on the green. There's just a little walkway behind the property, which gives you a little more separation from the golf course, but you're like literally right there. And these windows are frosted. Wonder why. It has the combo of the induction top and gas again. Just blends into the cabinets. Yeah. The garage is that way, so we'll we'll exit that way. Let's take a look at the view side of the house first. This is the owner suite. And you get views through these three massive windows. A little bit of a view that way. Beautiful fireplace. It's perfect on a day like today. It feels like it has snowed during almost every parade lately. Yeah, this room is, how would, what would you explain the shape as? Like we're in a corner. I did not do a great job explaining the shape of this room, but as you can see, it's not square. We didn't mic Michonne up today for reason of Oksana coming with us. Say hi. Nope. Oh yeah. <laughs> She's talkative so that it'd go right into the microphone. So. I can't even tell the shape of any of these rooms. They're all like different shapes. Really nice large shower. With a standalone tub. Really elegant, simple, understated. I'm a huge fan of the overall design and style and even the finishes in this home because this is a true representation of homes of the ledges. This this side of the ledges has properties that you can you can sort of expect. You could think of this home as a model home because I feel like it fits in super well. I think there's one or two more. Total of five bedrooms. Yeah. It's accessible through the front, but I don't think it's attached to the house. There's a hallway bath. A lot of um, vertical, vertical subway tile this year. And this room, I guess, is set up in an off office. I guess that would be like the quietest room in the house because it's tucked away. If you come here on vacation, I want to get some work done.
So only two bedrooms on the main floor. And then a casita. Yeah, plus a casita, three. I love walkout basements on the golf course because you have access to the back. There's a little potting green back there. Again, the shape of this room, every room in this house, huh? There's another bedroom this way. So this essentially mirrors the upstairs suite. It's the same shape. I wonder where the extra space went downstairs to replace the kitchen upstairs. There must be another really large bedroom. This home feels a lot more traditional than most of the other homes that we've seen in this parade. A little modern touch with the cabinets, but by the most part, it's kind of traditional Southern Utah architecture. I like it. Nice and light. Good choice of colors. There's a laundry room downstairs. I think there's one upstairs as well. Another bath. Ooh, the shower school. It's got gray tile that goes all the way to ceiling. kids room, bunk bedroom. So this is how this space was utilized. Oksana is getting excited about this space. <laughs> it's pretty spacious. They've got some cool, cool Utah art. Let us know what you guys think. What do you guys think about a more traditional house like this? Also, if you have been watching these videos but haven't subscribed yet, for some reason you should take an opportunity to do so now. Give this video a like if you've enjoyed it so far. Give it a dislike if it's too slow or too fast or whatever reason it is, but do me a favor and let me know why you gave it a dislike. I'd like to improve in the next one. Let's go look at the casita and we'll pop back in. <laughs> We're just gonna pop out of the casita and I'll come right back in. There's a party in a casita already. It's got some cool looking built ins. It's a proper guest suite. Some really cool built-ins that are consistent with the main house, same countertops, very similar cabinets. A drawer? That is a uh, freezer drawer. So your fridge and freezer is built in. That's actually really cool. I didn't even know until Michon pointed it out. The cool little light fixture I forgot to turn on. And the ensuite is actually very spacious as well. Let's go check out the garage.
kitchen or the front entry. There's your main level laundry room. Cool little mudroom. Folks, this property is available for sale. It's currently listed for 1.9 million. I will drop the full MLS link in the description below. If you're even remotely considering moving to Southern Utah, you might have some questions. Please feel free to call us, text us, reach out to us anytime. Thank you so much for tuning in and I will see you in the next one. It is also being sold turnkeys, I'm being told by Michonne. So all the furnishings that you see in this property are included with that $1.9 million offer price. That's my camera crew today. Look at these. And they the cutest. <laughs> Look at these guys. It's cold out. Say hi. Come on. Bye. -bye. Bye. It's freezing. Bye.